I this week attended an assessment centre for a vacation scheme. Okay guys, I apologise in advance, but we're getting two sessions of Johnny Geeking Out today, and I'd love to say that I cared what you thought, but uh, I just love it too much. <laughs> yes, I watch Love Island Judge Me if you like. I just think it's good fun. I want to start off this video by giving my heartfelt gratitude to all of you that watched last week's vlog and the amazing reaction and comments that you gave. Um, it, I was quite open about things on that vlog and I hope it helps some of you. Anyway, today's vlog, I've got so much to catch up on. Oh my goodness, like a squirrel just ran over my feet and I nearly had a heart attack. I've got so much to catch you guys up on. I um, have had some things going on this week. So, yep, I'll get into that in a bit. But starting out the day with a bit of reading and uh, some washing I've got to do. So let's get that student life going. By the way, uh, I, I'm assuming you guys are interested in my washing habits. If you're not, please skip to the next section. Right, now we've got to reserve a washer. The whole washing process is done via an app online, um, which is actually really helpful, I think. I've got um, friends at other colleges who don't have it like done this way and it's so much easier like it's now reserved for the next 10 minutes so if I go down there I know I'm going to be able to put some washing on so let's go okay let's remake the bed Right, let's pour ourselves some orange juice and get on with the day. All right, it is time for my geeking out of the week, one of my favorite times. And I am now doing a bit of contract law. I'm doing a bit of contract law. I just said that twice, so smooth. And the topic today is called unconscionable bargains. And I do know a bit about this, so I can tell you, and I'm sure you want to know. It's all about um, where a contract is made, haha, <laughs> surprise, and one of the parties has done something really sneaky and really bad to get the other party to enter into the contract. Anyway, really interesting. I'm gonna carry on with this. I've just been to collect the washing. There it is. Now I've got to hang it up on my drying rack, which is a slightly tedious task. Right, washing all done. Um, there is a big satisfaction that comes with doing it because it's like, I'm taking care of myself, makes me feel good. Um, anyway, now I just have some prep I need to do. I've got two supervisions this afternoon, which is a bit of an intense day, but I, yeah, I'm gonna take some quick prep notes and hopefully, yeah, then it'll be lunchtime going out for lunch. It's exciting, wait till you guys see. I am now off to lunch, I am going on a bit of a wander. Basically my college is sort of on the outskirts of Cambridge and there's a little village nearby um, which has these awesome, amazing little bakeries and artisan shops and they sell fresh hummus and flatbreads, focaccia, um, olives. So we're gonna go explore. That lunch was absolutely delicious. Um, I'm now off to a contract law supervision, uh, which is gonna keep me busy for the next hour. Um, obviously I can't film uh, for that period, so I will see you guys afterwards. I'll let you know all about how it went. Hey guys, just made it back um, from my supervision. I actually, went for a quick uh, coffee with my fellow law student friends. 
afterwards, which is really nice to catch up because we haven't really seen each other since the beginning of term. And um, yeah, I'm now gonna sit down, do some work. I've got another supervision in just about an hour and a half's time. So do a bit of prep, also get a bit ahead on some other work I need to do. It's Friday evening, so um, yeah nearly the weekend day. Eh? So guys, I'm actually just logging onto my computer to do some work and I thought I'd just give you the weekly update because I've had so many things that have happened this week that I wanna um, share with you guys. So Monday was actually my birthday. Saw me turn 21, which is quite a big number. I had a great time and my girlfriend did the most wonderful day for me. She planned out a whole itinerary. Lily is her name, by the way. Um, I know I talk about her a lot as my girlfriend. I'll call her Lily from now on. She made me a really nice dinner. She took me out to an olive bar. We went out for breakfast, had the nicest coffee, and she made me a three course dinner. It was so nice. And also, and perhaps more relevant than my birthday, although clearly my birthday is just, I, this week attended an assessment centre for a vacation scheme I applied for. I still haven't heard back and the likelihood is I probably haven't got it, but I thought I would just share my experience with you guys um, so you can know what it's like if you're interested in applying for vacation schemes. Vacation schemes, by the way, are kind of like a lawyer's internship, so an internship at a law firm. I had to get up I had a quite ghastly hour on Wednesday morning um, and I had to travel to London to be there by 9.30. The train took about an hour and 10 minutes and then we pulled up into Liverpool Street and I waddle waddled my way out of the station into the office, which was literally right next door. How fortunate. So once I arrived, we got taken to this kind of big conference room where everyone was racing, was, everyone was waiting and they had bacon rolls with ketchup, it was so nice. So I uh, indulged in one of those, as I should. And the day began with a kind of introductory talk with a partner and the head of graduate recruitment, uh, all about the firm, kind of, this partner was really lovely. He gave sort of anecdotal stories over his years of experience and the work he's done all over the world and yeah, it kind of just set up the day on a really positive note. After that, it was very much time for the assessments to get underway. That took us to about 1 p.m. Then there was an hour long lunch, networking lunch with lawyers at the firm, which was really good. And then I had to sit around from two until 3.30 when my interview was, and the interview took place with a partner um, and a member of the HR team. And I was asked a series of questions and actually, I really enjoyed it. For me, highlight of the day, I got to just really be myself. The partner made me feel really comfortable. It was really lovely. And I would really love to work at the firm because there's just such a good atmosphere. And I really just let myself be myself. And if I get the job, then great. They liked who, who I was. If I don't, then clearly it wasn't the best fit for me. It was a great day and a great experience, if nothing else. And all you guys out there hoping to apply for internships, vacation schemes, anything, um, please, let's hear from you in the comments. I would love to um, hear and I'd love to reply to your comments if you've got any questions or, I mean, I don't know that much, but if you just wanna like talk about it, I'd love to. Uh, anyway, I've got some work to do. Let's get on with the rest of the video. Okay guys, I apologize in advance, but we're getting two sessions of Johnny Geeking Out today and I'd love to say that I cared what you thought, but uh, I just love it too much. <laughs> so actually, I think I've got a really interesting one for you today. Oh, it's playing. I am doing work on human rights law, which is one of my faves, I must say. And today's um, portion is on migrant rights, which actually is a fascinating area of the law. And it's really topical at the moment with stuff going on in government and um, I would love to practice in this area one day if I got the opportunity. All done with that. My brain is burning a little bit now because it was quite a tricky lecture. It's now dark outside. It's very much the evening time and I have a supervision. So let's go.
So I just finished my supervision. I realise it's very dark outside, so I'm now standing underneath a lamppost. Probably looking like a weirdo to everyone else, but I'm committed to the content. I am now uh, heading back to mine and Lily's coming over and we're gonna go do some singing because uh, it's just a little thing that we do every Friday night. We go practice some musical theatre songs because it's just a bit of fun. And then it's dinner time and I'm making veggie pasta with chia butter, garlic, bread. It's gonna be ooh, just what I need. <laughs> Guys, let's get serious, yeah? It's dinner time and I'm hungry. Today, making um, veg pasta with mozzarella, which I'm so excited for. And we are having the best garlic bread. These Tesco finest chia batters are just, oh, what's planned this evening? Gonna make some dinner, uh, then. I'm gonna have a shower slash bath, curl up and watch Love Island. Yes, I watch Love Island, judge me if you like. I just think it's good fun. Hi guys, that's gonna top off the video for this week. Hope you've enjoyed it. I have very much enjoyed getting back into the swing of things this term. If you have any questions, any queries, any comments, you know where to leave them down below. Please, please do like and subscribe to the channel. I'll see you all very, very soon, but until then, stay awesome.